Hey, welcome back to Let's Play Heavy Rain. We uh, joined Ethan Mars stealing this taxi. So, when the game crashed last episode, I had to do the whole uh, escape from the cops thing again. Alright, I feel bad now. I think there might have been some sort of trophy or whatever that the game kind of messed up on and didn't want to give me. So, uh, oh. now, now, thankfully, it has, uh, it has loaded correctly. So, did you end up getting the trophy? I don't think so. Damn it! All that work for nothing. Who cares? <laughs> it's the trophies, well, man! Don't you want to 100% this game? What we do care is about Scott Shelby. I care about Scott Shelby. We're going to continue his investigation. He's coming back to his office, probably to review the facts and maybe achieve a, hitter, a hidden conclusion or something. Ah, all right, Shelby, what you got? Let's go on in. Is that a doorknob in the middle of the door? I know, right? What the fuck? How European hey, is here. this thing? Lord? I'm sorry, Scott. Oh, uh, right, what? Shelby. I told oh, you no. It's Kramer. Your son is a serial killer. How many people does he have to kill before you turn him in? Gordy has his faults, but he's still my son. You have but no children. He's a serial Shelby. killer. You can't possibly understand. You leave me no choice. Your investigation is over. For good. Hey, hey, thanks, Lord, for turning me in. And now I'm being knocked out and I'm going to be probably killed. By the origami and You killer. can't figure out who killed your son. And, oh, yeah, I'm in a car underwater now. That's great. What? Oh, my God. Oh, Shelby, right. figure this one out. And for your troubles, Lauren's in here, too. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. Way to go, you dumb bitch. <laughs> you turned me in, and now you're going to die with me. How the hell well, do you get right. out of this? All right, so we got some things left to do here. Um, okay, uh, I guess we'll try and move our hands out. Well, can't no. really do that. That's 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 fruitless. Okay, well, dough shit. <laughs> uh, that's not good. Uh, maybe I can oh, turn God. the car and oh, the lights are on. That's nice. <laughs> At least we have that. All right. If I just finagle. Oh. Ah, oh. oh, there we go. Yes. Burn the rope a little bit. So yep, carefully, yep, yep. Carefully. We can Ger die in this if we don't do this right. We can totally die. And got it. There. Good. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, ah, shit. Oh, did shit. you drop it? He dropped it. I didn't. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm meaning you as a collective. <laughs> Fortunately, that's enough to get us free. So oh, thank Christ. So now we got to get out. And now we get to the second question that I asked you for this weekend. Shit! Save yourself! You said yes! Oh no! Save yourself! You oh, said no! yes! So now, oh, no! thanks to you, we're gonna leave Lauren in the car <laughs> to die! Oh, son of a bitch! You have doomed her! How... Could you? Oh, is it too late to take it back? <laughs> yes, it's, it is very late. <laughs> oh, crap. I really did ruin everything. <laughs> you did, my God. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, shit. Just leave her to die. Oh, See ya. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> That's pretty daring. I never would have done that. But you, you went the extra mile and... Well, that's what happens when I don't have context. Exactly. But don't worry. Maybe uh, the next question, which will be in this next section here, will make things better. <laughs> no, they won't. You bastard, I'm going to kill you, he says to a mirror. So, that was a very short section, but it is continued by another section. We are doing the continuation of Scott's Revenge. Oops. Sorry, colon, oops. Well, even if you would have saved her or not, he still would have done what he's about to do. Yeah, but at least you got some DLC on this story. You killed Lauren, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna go... For everything they've done. He's a little I'm mad. Waste that cocksucker. Yep. So we're gonna drive into the... Oh, wait, I should probably... 
Put turn, it in yeah, drive. Put it That's in it. drive. Okay. There we go. All right, and into the gates. And special delivery. <laughs> What's up, motherfuckers? I'm here to take down Kramer! So, for that whole attempted murder thing, we're gonna go throughout uh, Kramer's house and kill every motherfucker in here. Oh, sweet. Oh, put a cap in him. He's not dead. Starting with this guy. Oh, thank God. Yes. So, we've got about, like, I'd say five hits or so before we fail. But there's She'll a lot of dudes mad. here. She'll be mad! She'll be very mad. Take She'll out that be guy. Mad. And then we'll take out that guy. These are all triggers. All L1 and R1 and R L2 and R2. Is that Shelby Hawkeye? Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, missed it. There's a trophy for doing this whole section perfectly, but oh, oh that didn't work. Alright, so you got three hits left. I'm not a gun nut, so I don't know if that gun has to reload or not. It's a huge magazine if it doesn't. Yeah. Bang. Oh. Oh. oh ow. And there's three hits. Where is Kramer? Bang. Oh. Probably in there. <laughs> Does he have a magnum? That oh, guy flew off his feet. Jesus. I love this Dirty Harry sequel. <laughs> Look how far they fly. My God. Wait, it Wait, wait, is that what this is? Did uh, David Cage watch Dirty Harry and he thought of this scene? I love the raw emotion of Dirty Harry. Uh, should have reloaded the gun. Ugh. Fucking asshole. Should have actually fired the gun. Please, don't hurt me. Mm. Uh, mm. not an option. Mm. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna hit ya. Uh, this is for Lauren, who I totally didn't leave to die. Bah! Got him. You ever been killed by a ghost, sir? <laughs> <laughs> Thought you were about to whack him on the back of the head. Lauren is dead. You fucking killed her. Stop. <laughs> I beg you. Oh, my God. I'm glad they don't, uh, I'm glad we don't feel guilt. I don't feel guilty at all. Your idiot son killed all those kids, didn't he? He's the origami killer. No, no. Thankfully, he can say origami not correctly. Not a killer. Uh, go over there. Maybe it's one of those instances where he's a killer, but he's not the origami killer. Huh? Tell me the truth. No, no, please, don't hurt me. Last chance. I don't know. I swear. Where were the other drugs going? Why? Stop! Stop! I beg you. Uh huh. I'll tell you everything. Okay, fine. Start talking before I crush your windpipe. Uh, Lordy. So, Lordy, can you actually kill him before fun, he you know? spills everything? He wanted to. Probably not. To be like the origami killer. He kidnapped that kid. And he held him under the water for a little too long. It Why would you accident. want to be like an not origami killer, accident. you idiot? Because we don't have the actual origami the killer. Gordy is just everything. a copycat. He was crying. He was so sorry for what had happened. I, I know, but I'm thinking of the process. Why would I want to be like a serial killer? Gordy, What's the maybe point? Maybe it's an awesome serial killer. Gordy, I mean, don't... Son. There's probably at least one serial killer you wish you probably were. Not really, because they're serial oh, killers. Well, yeah, but, you mean, that's what makes what? them so alluring. That boy, Gordy killed. No one will miss him. The street track. <gasps> Gordy was the one driving the car that killed you the other kid. Pile of shit. So I call this just shut. Stop fucking talking, Kramer. Because he, Shelby's gonna try to leave. And he's gonna say John something Shelby? that's gonna make him come back and hit Why him. Did you put flowers on his I, grave? I own the construction site where he died. Ah. Oh. I've been putting flowers on his grave for thirty years. Oh wait, John this is the reveal, isn't it? What happened to him? Oh, was I, I right? Know. He was adopted. Ah, I think. fuck. You're almost. Mother, we're so close there, but we're everyone's closing in on John Shepard's Shepherd. twin brother. 
most likely he is the origami killer. Because Gordy is just a copycat, you know, stupid kid who's got a, you know, well-off dad who gets him out of all the trouble in the world. Come and work for me, Shelby. I'll pay you well. You'll be able to have all the girls you want. Wrong things to say. Never mm -hmm. say her name again. You hear me? Never. Who? So now it's time for question three. My heart. What the fuck did I say? I mean, the I know I did was, the wrong one, but... The question was, help him? Oh, you fucking God said yes. Oh. We're going to save this man, but we're going to do it very, very slowly. Hmm, I wonder which drawer you had your heart pills in. Oh, no! Do you know where they could be? I don't know. I haven't been in here before. Hey, they at could least be I was anywhere. able to make some chaos. <laughs> and ruin Please. everything. Open the drawer. <laughs> here are your pills. You got a lot of these. Are, are these the ones? <laughs> why were three of those options leave? I mean, I know why. Hey, you want these? You want these? This what you want? These right here? <laughs> oh, d damn sh child safety locks. Hang on, I got arthritis. Let me just... Thank you. You... You saved my life. I already regret it. Well, way to go, Niskel. You killed Lauren and you saved the bad guy. Son of a bitch. Congrats. But, but hey, those were two things I did not do in my first playthrough, so the ending that we get could be radically different. Great. So no. to close things out, we're going to head back to Madison, see what the hell she's up to after oh, failing to alert Ethan of the cops. Well, just as long as I don't have to, like, sleep with anybody who's going to die. Oh, wait, that all of my choices are done, so that's good. Yes, yeah, so th this is just... This is just story stuff. Nothing, nothing, anything too exploitative. This is meant to be all story, all plot. Because we're going to go see somebody very, very special who could probably let us know what is going on and maybe get us that much closer as to who the origami killer really is. <laughs> oh, we're going to go see Ann Shepard. We're going to go see Ann Shepard, the mother of John Shepard. And, John by extension, the mother ago. of the twin brother of John Shepard, who was probably the origami killer. Puzzle. So, if anybody can tell us the answer, it's Aunt Shepard. Oh, please let me be right. Please let me have called it, like, ten episodes in. <laughs> well, we're gonna find out. We gotta get the, we gotta Hello, get the answers I'm first. I'm looking for Aunt Shepard's room. I think that's please when I made that book. call. Maybe it was just a couple episodes ago. God, the dial tone is easier to catch than syphilis. Oh god, it's a sexually transmitted dial tone. Still an STD, still counts. Mm. Have I ever told you that your gameplay is genius? <laughs> Ma'am? Are you okay? Okay, I'll move. Are you a member of the family? <laughs> yeah, you could say that. So oh, very easy to just to mess up David Cage's no perfect, you know, you. this is the, the story Alzheimer's I've crafted with my characters and emotional. Oh, of course she has Alzheimer's. Yep, it's so. room 19 at the end of the corridor. Thank you. Uh, so please don't let this be a wild goose chase. Please. Room Hopefully she remembers the names of her son. Where is that? Sorry, name of her son, not plural. Room 19. Where is that? Uh, it's probably in between room, room 18 19. and room 20. Room Where is 19. that? Uh, let's see. Where is room 19? Room 19. Where is that? Well, there's room 8 and 19. 9. Where is that? Well, that's Sorry, 10. 8 and 10. Room 19. I forgot Where the way they that? design rooms is... That's room not 19. two rooms on the side. Two, Where yeah, is that? two rooms on each side. Room Got it. nineteen. Ooh, flowers. Is that? Room nineteen. Where is that? Uh, there's thirteen. That's not nineteen. Nineteen. 
Where hey, is David that? Cage, I understand that it's room 19 now. Room 19. I'm not that stupid. What is that? I I'm doing that, you know. Room I 19. know, but it's still... The, the fact that, that they give you the option is kind of demeaning. Okay, fine. Room 19 at the where end of the corridor. That? Well, where the fuck is it? This leads to the stairs. Room 19. <laughs> where is that? And this Bro. is... Ooh, it's a snack area, like a break oh, room. Oh, sweet. Can I get, like, any coffee or... No. Oh, let's take all their fruity room fizz. 19. I, want, I want fruity fizz. It looks good. It's like where Sprite, but fruitier. Room mm, 19. Fruity Sprite. Where is that? Okay, so that's room, room 20. Room 19. Which means right that? here. Room 19. Where is that? I take it back. Your gameplay is not genius. I, I was trying to do that, but they took away the whole figure oh, out where room did. 19 is. So like, when we see it, we know where it is. So, oh, crap. Okay, fine. I'll play your game. And we'll go inside. Blam, 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 blam. <laughs> it was an ambush. <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Shepard. Is it time for my pills already? No, Mrs. Shepard, I then never find my pills. I don't know what they do here. Commander Shepard went the on some hard hospital, times. They were always on time, but here. So, this is a quote-unquote. Puzzle. My name is Madison Page. We're going to try and extract information from her Alzheimer's rattled brain like about her two sons, about one of son. which she doesn't even remember all that much. I don't like this hospital. The food isn't very good, you know. It's made from that hack Bobby Flay, you know. That Gordon Ramsay doesn't know a damn thing. Do you remember John? My Johnny. He is a good little boy, you know. Loves swimming. You had a son named John. <laughs> so John bad. Had a twin so brother. Good. Do you have my pills? It's time for my pills. Yeah, yeah, okay, you old bat. We'll get you your pills. Just hold on. I know what happened at Carnaby Square. Do you remember? Carnaby Square. Just can't find I a comfortable position to interrogate this woman. Ago. I think you might be giving her anxiety. Much money at the time, you know. <laughs> Just moving around all over the place. It's like, I need to know about your sons. Is there anything you can tell me about your sons? I need to know in great detail about what his name was. And maybe you can help son, me figure out. There are many little boys who are dead now because brother. of him. What was his name? You sit down in the corner and break out what a megaphone. Son? Where is your son? I have no other son. I never had any children. But, no, great. But, you just ruined the puzzle. Never had any. Are you serious, bitch? Foster family. I remember, Mrs. Shepard. John's twin brother was placed with a foster family after the accident. What was the name of the foster family? Okay, so that's what I we're really looking to find. You know? Because if they we know the name of the foster family, money. then we'll know exactly, exactly who the origami killer really is. Right. I think your son is in trouble, Mrs. Shepard. We gotta extract that from her because she's not things. being that cooperative because she's, you know, old and dumb and shit. Do you understand? No, well, it's Terrible Alzheimer's. Things you're telling me. He never yeah, came to I, I got a feeling half of this is is the Alzheimer's. The other half is just her being, you know, stubborn, you know, no one evasive. Their mother, do they? Well, Mrs. Shepard, your son may be linked to a series of murders. Perhaps you have some information that could help Hi, uh, yes, ma'am. Your son's a serial killer. Can you Are tell you me who he is? Oh, oh sure. John kidding. Travolta. What? Well, that was easy. <laughs> Arrest him, boys! <laughs> the cuffs are on Travolta. It days, if not longer, oh, to find the name of the family that adopted her son. Ooh, hey, John Mars would be dead by then. Oh, she's the origami killer. Great. Okay, well, maybe... Okay, so the crane is the whole symbol. I mean, there's one on the screen right now, so... Just... Oh, God. X I, I bet you anything, if I know writing, you're gonna square. make an origami crane, and then uh, she's gonna be like, Oh, I remember that. That's, uh, my other boy. Let's see if you're right. Oh, you're the origami killer. Cover, boys! <laughs> what?! It really was an ambush. Thing. So the crane didn't do anything, but she loves origami, so, you know, okay. it makes sense. If she's the mother of the origami killer, the origami killer would have to be good at, you know, <clears throat> origami. 
So what's her favorite? I like the crane, but there's the hummingbird. Mm -hmm. There's, the, there's dog. the dog. Oh, that's cute. And then the frog. Hmm. Uh, we'll try the dog. Okay. I like dogs. Dogs are dogs are nice. Everyone loves a good little doggo, especially if it's a paper doggo. Looks like a Sheba. It looks like we're folding the exact same pattern. Good. Well, all origami is the same, right? You just kind of, you know, just uh, take 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 a piece of paper, oh, fold it around a little bit, and oh, hey, look, I made a I canary. I loved origami. I taught them how to do it. John loved the little dogs. He always wanted to call them Max. Max, Max, Max. All dogs with the same name. What a stupid child. I'm telling him they couldn't all have the same name. Mm. But he always wanted his paper dogs Max. It's funny, isn't it? Hilarious, ma'am. That's the name of my other boy. It seems to be working. She's remembering so there's, stuff. There's three jolts to her memory that will give us the answers that we need. Show her. That was mm -hmm. the first one. The second one here is... Did you make well, these origami figures? My little paper animals. They played with them for hours. I'm going to put them on an ark. The rain is coming, you I know. I my boys how to <laughs> make them, you know. Yes, your boys, boys Mrs. Shepard. John and... What was your other son's name again? My other son? I only had one son. God damn it. Jeez. <laughs> uh, your, <sighs> your second son is repressed memory. That's what you mother. kept calling him. Must be some way to get oh. him to remember. Anything in the bathroom that we can use? Anything that can help? I don't mm. think so. So we gotta leave for a second. Oh, maybe we can get some help from that nurse down there. Oh, okay. Hello! Does Mrs. Shepard ever talk about her past? It's not all very clear to Who her. Who are now. you? Sometimes she'll remember the oddest things, though. I suppose if she sees something that reminds her of her past. Okay. Did she ever mention her sons? Sons? Well, she often mentions John. I, I think he drowned. Does so she, she remembers the dead son? one. I didn't but, know she had But not one. the living one. I've never heard her mention it. Never heard her mention it. Does she any, get many visitors? Any visitors? She's been here for ten years and you're the first. Oh, that's sad. Sometimes, if you show her things, it seems to trigger a memory from her past. <laughs> hint, you might get it to remember. Hint, hint. <laughs> Thanks for the advice. So there's more to do down here, and I kind of like this show scene her that take her back. in terms of like uh, construction of a scene. The way the hallway is seen, you know, on the left side we had the nurse who tells us that we should probably do this stuff. But what's the other thing you notice? Other thing I notice on the right. The fact that it's darker? In this hallway, I mean. Talk to the nurse, nothing to do with her now. Get out of my way. But what's the other thing that you'd noticed? Uh. I mean, we looked at them on our way through here. The doors? Oh! There, it's a flower, and what kind of flower is it? A pretty oh, important. no! <laughs> a pretty goddamn important flower. It's an orchid! Yeah. Huh. Origami killer always leads an origami and an orchid. So maybe oh, the yes. Orchid I forgot. My second son's name was Orchid, my favorite Killer Instinct character. <laughs> he used to play Saber Wolf all the time. <laughs> and I always kicked his ass. Ultra combo, sure noob. Back. <laughs> Get on my level, scrub. <laughs> So just slip that in there. Oh, lovely there you go. orchid. My sons loved orchids. We used to grow them in the back. What was when the other John kid's died, name? I laid orchids on his grave. Well, that's part two, but uh, <sighs> okay. we need we need something else. One more thing to trigger everything. Let's see. Anything in here? Doesn't look like it. How about the top one? Oh, a photo. <gasps> yes. I never knew she had two sons. Are these your children, Mrs. Shepard? Photo with two John sons? And brother. 
Is that them? They are good little boys. Their father never looked after them, always drinking. They didn't have an easy life, you know. As far as I can rem remember, at least. Come on, give me the goods. What's the name? I cried when they told me. I'd already lost one of my children, and now they were taking away another one, you understand? Yeah. So what was the family's name? Family, Mrs. Shepherd. Come on. Give me the name! Foster family that Give me the name. Brother. They were really very nice people. I met them Tell me a the fucking name! <laughs> in the beginning, I used to go and see my little boy. And then I got sick and I couldn't go any longer. Perhaps he thought I'd forgotten him. I mean, I literally I did, but no, anymore. I would never forget. Old what's-his-face. What was the name? Hey, Mrs. Shepherd, what was his name? But I loved him. If you only knew how much I missed him. Please, Anne. I don't even think you his know name. how much you miss him. What was his name? Come closer. <laughs> Dude! Son of a bitch. She just burps right in her ear, just... Uh. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Disgusting old crone! So not even we get to know until the next time? Was I right or not? We're gonna find out the identity of the origami killer. Next time on Let's Play Heavy Rain! Oh, no! <laughs> God! <laughs> oh, the we just part, phased through her. <laughs> the best part is I know who it is, and you're gonna love the... Mate, well... <laughs> Did I at least get close? <laughs> Fuck! Mm.